Welcome to HortTube. My name is Jim Putnam. This is the Subscriber Sunday video where subscribers send in photos of gardening things that they are proud of in their yard or their community. If you're interested in sending in photos for this, this is the email address right here. Uh, just include Subscriber Sunday photos or something like that in the title so I don't, don't lose your photos. If I have um, uh, missed a few, uh, I apologize. There were, this was the most I had ever had and it does take a little while to go through all those emails and you know download those photos. And uh, Make sure uh, if you're out taking photos, turn your phone sideways or your camera side. Make, make sure you're taking them, uh, you know, in widescreen because people are watching these videos uh, on television and, and on widescreen formats. If you take them like this, you know, with your phone up like this, then I have to alter. I don't mind, but I have to alter your photo a little bit to get it to fill up the whole screen. And sometimes I can't even do that. So just keep that in mind. Turn your phone sideways and it makes for a much better uh, YouTube uh, photo. <laughs> Uh, if that makes any sense. Uh, a couple of uh, updates uh, on the channel real quick, and one of them is, is pretty big. I, am, uh, I grew up in the city of Raleigh. Uh, my intention has been to go back to the city of Raleigh at some point in, uh, in, in my adult life. I came out here to the uh, suburbs. I'm in a great community. Uh, it was a great community to raise a child uh, who's now in college. And uh, uh, I really, the community I'm in has, has good schools. It's a great community. I'm only like 25 or 30 minutes from Raleigh, but unless there's traffic and then it's, then it's over an hour. Uh, but my intent has always been to get back to the city. I had kind of intended to uh, be in this space a little while longer and then move there, but um, opportunity has knocked, I guess we could, we could call it. And uh, I am heading back there. I'm actually going to list this house uh, in the next month, uh, month and a half, something like that. And uh, so I've got a lot of work left to do. There'll be a couple more months where the video's here. Uh, I used to get a lot of questions at the garden center about you know, selling houses and what to do in the yard and people coming in and buying plants and that kind of thing. So I feel like I've got a pretty good handle on, uh, on being able to shoot some videos for, for real estate folks as well uh, in, in, in terms of you know, how, to, how to get a yard ready to, to sell. And so I'll be shooting those. I have about 40 more pieces to go in the ground here that are sitting, you know, right over here, kind of behind the camera uh, that, uh, that'll be going in. So there's lots more videos here. There's a, this, this will be a lot more completed uh, when I leave here. And I know this will be kind of sudden. The place I'm going to though is a blank slate. It's an urban lot. It's smaller than this for sure. Um, but it's going to be an opportunity to start from, you know, from, from the blank slate. Um, we can do soil test. We can put in an irrigation system from the ground up where I already had. A lot of these things were partially done here, and I haven't really been able to teach them. I'm going to put in a rain garden to uh, so, so, because I think this is one of the futures of landscaping. I think almost all landscapes in the future will have rain gardens trying to get prevent water from rushing directly into our sewer systems and causing flash flooding in the urban settings and also helping filter you know, things that are in our contaminants that are in our yard out of the water before they run directly into our creeks and streams. So you'll see that. I mean, there's a lot of fence project and like lots and lots of projects on this, uh, in this new space that, like I say, will be from the ground up. And so I think that overall for the channel, um, it is actually going to be a great thing because people, you'll be able to see the documentation of an entire landscape, a very, very detailed landscape project uh, over time. Like I say, I've got about two months left uh, here, uh, and there'll be lots and lots of videos coming on how I, how I finished out this space. In terms of folks that are watching me for propagation videos, you're about to see some propagation videos. I have plants in this yard that I definitely want to take with me, and uh, you're always a, there's always a risk of digging a plant up and moving it that I'm going to kill it. I mean, I've killed plants, plenty of plants transplanting plants. And so what I'm going to do is go through the yard and, and determine the plants that I want to make sure that I'm taking with me that I'm going to dig up and move, but I'm going to take cuttings on them. So we'll have rooted cuttings. So even if my original plant dies, uh, we'll have a backup uh, in, in rooted cuttings. So uh, the propagation folks, you'll start seeing those videos uh, um, uh, this week. And I think that'll be interesting to people because if you want to share plants with people and that kind of thing, uh, maybe you'll uh, learn, learn some things from that, some inexpensive ways, and then kind of a very detailed uh, a greenhouse that I built in the backyard uh, last year. Uh, if, you're, if you're interested in, in really getting into the, uh, the details of uh, that, that type of propagation. So anyway, uh, <laughs> that's a lot of information. I'm also doing a fall uh, tour that will start in Raleigh in late September. I'm gonna go, um, I'll be at a garden center in Raleigh and then one in Charlotte and one in Columbia, South Carolina and possibly a couple in the Atlanta area. They'll just be, um, 
I'll give some sort of presentation, for, you know, pull, pull plants in, in that garden center, some interesting things that you might be interested in, and then I'll do a Q&A. You know, I'll open it up to question and answer after that. That's probably where I'm most comfortable. I've done this for so long that I'm, I'm you know, I'm comfortable getting, you know, you want to ask about the turf or the shrubs or, you know, whatever you want to ask about them. I'm fairly comfortable uh, taking those questions. So if you're interested, I will, I, the, I'll have the details on those things by the uh, 1st of August on, on, on what weekends and, and what days that I'll be at those, uh, at those events. Here are the subscriber Sunday photos and thanks everyone for watching.